At the nation's capital, the House of Representatives will conduct a public hearing over the Control of Infectious Diseases Bill to allow Nigerians contribute to the draft law. Speaker Femi Gwajabi Amila was reacting during today's plenary to the controversy the document has generated so far. The Presidential Task Force on COVID-19 was also present to brief lawmakers and seek a legislative framework that will address future pandemics in the country. National Assembly correspondent Joke Adisa reports. Last Tuesday, Speaker Femi Gbajabi Amila stepped down from his seat to present a bill seeking to repeal the Quarantine Act and enact the Infectious Diseases Control Bill. The first and second readings were taken almost immediately, but members kicked against the third reading. Since then, controversy has trolled the bill, with many describing it as a hatchet job from the international community. Cop spokesman Ikenga Ugochiri, in a video that went viral, instigated opposition lawmakers against the leadership of the House, even as a former member of the Senate Dino Milai filed a case in court to challenge the speaker on the bill. Now the House has decided to react, insisting the bill was conceived in the interest of the public. It has resolved to add to the courts. To pursue um, legal remedy, I think that will, be, will serve as a lesson um, to many others out there. Meanwhile, the Presidential Tax Force on COVID-19 wants the National Assembly to develop a legal framework that will get the country prepared for any future pandemic. The National Assembly develop a legislative framework for reforming and transforming our health care system, strengthen the legislative framework for economic growth. It was also an opportunity for the lawmakers to seek clarification from the NCDC Director General regarding his comments that laws are not amended in the middle of a crisis. Is the current virus, the COVID-19, is it covered by the Quarantine Act? But I was answering to a specific question by the journalist at the time. Had I been consulted, the only honest answer to give at the time was that I hadn't been, because I hadn't been. At the end of the interface between the lawmakers and members of the Presidential Tax Force on COVID-19, which lasted for more than three hours, both parties resolved to work hand in hand to tame the coronavirus pandemic in the overall interest of the people. Jokia TVC News, Abuja.